guys, welcome to Nendo Twin 22. Vanessa here speaking, and today we have another unboxing video, and this is an Android. So for this, this is Android Restart. <laughs> okay, I hope I got it right. And the number is one three five three. So this Android is actually from the anime series called cautious hero the hero is overpowered but overly cautious <laughs> very nice name for an anime i believe <laughs> anyway so i like um the idea of collecting this kind of dolls that's kind of look angelic because honestly i'm very curious with the wings this comes with the wings i don't know if you can see though there it is okay <laughs> um yeah the primary is i think wearing the wings <laughs> so i have um wings for my nendoroid but um i don't i don't like how you know it will be placed on the nendoroid because i have to put it on the stand okay i hope that this is different from what i experienced with the other wing that i have so the one that I got is from is uh I forgot the name of it. It's extra parts of Nendoroid, it's not basically from another figure. It's I forgot if it's after parts is what they called it. I forgot. <laughs> it's years that I bought that um part anyway so this is the an android so as you can see this one looks like an angel actually this is a goddess that's a character with healing abilities novice goddess <laughs> okay now anyway this is the front of the box this is the side okay and this is don't know what's <laughs> why the sound oh my gosh forgive so this is the back this is the side this is the bottom and this is the top so anyway now with that being said <laughs> i will now unbox it okay let's see what's inside interesting big sticker so we'll lift it up with a card oh i we miss time zone guys it's been closed for a long time due to the pandemic okay this is time zone card so let's see this is the bottom part and at the bottom we will see there's a pamphlet here. What does it say? Android series. My first Android campaign. I can't hardly read what is this. Show off your collection for a chance to win the latest Nandroids. Wow. I wish I can join, but really, I only have a less now due to the fact that I'm not really collecting. I'm just keeping at least three figures that's really significant for me so i don't want to have a lot because before i have a lot you know and i realized that i am becoming greedy that's why i stopped collecting and i only um purchased stuff that i like with the let me call this like example i want the wings of this android and at the same time I also like this one there's a reason for me why i like it i'll show it to you guys later okay now this comes with a pamphlet and of course whatever this is <laughs> all right and by the way when i unbox uh, mafu mafu it doesn't have this so around this android they finally place this pamphlet okay on the android box i don't know until what number android number will they place this okay so let's see when until when so 
2019-04 and then 2020-12 so it means for February, March, April so it starts entry period starts um, from April 2019 up to 2020 December 2020 it's already over my gosh <laughs> it's already 2021 oh okay. never mind <sighs> it's been a long time maybe that I didn't unbox this <laughs> I've been busy guys for it I have another channel you know wow I like oh dear <laughs> what a funny face plate anyway so this is an android itself so it only comes with one layer only okay and two extra face plates um legs nice legs <laughs> legs and then extra arms and my head suddenly hurt <laughs> oh dear what happened so now we will remove the plastic cover so that we may have a closer look of the android forgive the noise we are unboxing that's why it's too nose and noisy <laughs> noisy okay we will remove wow there is an extra plastic here so that the androids will not get dirty and we will now take the main android so we may have a closer look okay i just place it aside and here is our android oh as you can see this android has a lot of plastics um it has a plastic on the bottom at the face part yeah that's all okay now we'll see we will remove the plastic so we may see honestly speaking i don't know if you feel comfortable with the color of the hair it intrigues me honestly and wow it's it's connected to the hair i wonder how can i okay how can i get off the face plate because looks look at that it's attached to the back of the hair hmm let me figure it out how can we remove it so let's see so there is a node on the hair okay we will remove hmm interesting i don't understand <laughs> I hope we got it right guys look at the description so I think we have to pull the pony okay the ponytail first and then we can be able to remove the the front hair you get me <laughs> let's see oh, I don't know that this is complicated so really forgive me for this Hmm. oh i get it we can remove this part see that and there yeah and i would say the ponytail is removable it has a small node here so you can see Ooh. and then place it back if you want the ponytail oh there you go we remove paws i don't know what the hair is called <laughs> the hair part i wonder if the ribbon is removable too but it seems attached honestly it's not removable it's only the pony that is removable and all the and also this part here but nice hair <laughs> honestly nice hair okay so now just complicated honestly that confused me <laughs> thank you description stuff <laughs> thank you bashir or the pamphlet oh dear instruction manual <laughs> can be so we'll remove the hair 
so here we go and then let's remove oh interesting i have to remove the body too there you go oh so the wings is attached to the hair really interesting i must saw so shocked i thought that i can use it to under and under it's well i guess not <laughs> this is shocking my gosh so we got it the wings is attached to the hair just like that <laughs> i will cry my gosh i thought that i can get the wings because the wings look so cute um but i'm not gonna keep the hair you know i like hairs that are black because yeah my hair is black and sometimes i want my mini mini android to wear angelic stuff <laughs> yeah with the theme of my other channel kind of angelic right so you place back the hair and again let's just place these little hair bits on its node just remove first the the pony tail so we can see where to place the nodes but carefully do that guys you might accidentally break this part here all right then attach oh attach the pony <laughs> very cute hair with wings <laughs> okay let me just remove the the plastics okay so here we got our nandroid uh, restart <laughs> am i right restart eh? sometimes i forgot the name me and my bad language speaking <laughs> we start uh, yeah I'm, I'm right so here is how um the dendroid looks like at the front and as you can see the primary faceplate is a smiley faceplate like na regular nendoroids <laughs> okay most nendoroids are like that and very nice dress honestly very detailed shoes really love the dress so cute i think i just colored the hair <laughs> no i just like the wings just too bad it's attached to the hair so shock <laughs> anyway so here is the back of the nandroid and you can see that there's a hole where you can attach the the stand support for this nandroid and here is the side here is the front again here is the bottom and she has white undies <laughs> as you can see and this is the top this is the back of the hair we've seen that and take note that the ribbon is not removable um you can detach the that touch the pony okay and also this little hair okay now we got that idea of <laughs> so let's just place an android here and she's not like other androids where an android can stand on its own so basically let's just let her lie down like this <laughs> all right now we talk alone with these faces here that we got oops right so the um this center it comes with two faces okay face extra face blades okay um let's first see this one so actually this is the thing that i'm planning to keep why <laughs> there's a reason behind it it's because i really like this okay um little things i really follow them in social media and i do love their drawings and take a look at this guys <laughs> right um the expression is kind of same with this um 
I don't know if it's comics that I follow because yeah <laughs> look how cute it is similar to the faceplate <laughs> similar expression so that's why this is very memorable for me so let's make um the nendoroid where the second this is the second yeah number two i don't know if you can see number two but there is okay this is a second face plate and let's see if there is dirt elsewhere because sometimes there is okay you will check if it fits this dendroid because sometimes it doesn't fit if there's a defect just hope this one doesn't <laughs> so far i didn't see any so let's just carefully remove the node so we can attach that i will just remove the pony okay because uh-huh it's very hard to touch so for the main faceplate as you can see she has violet eyes it's a side this is the number one faceplate which is the main one for this nandroid so we'll make her wear this funny face blade crying face blade because there's some teary effects here on the side but she looks angry with <laughs> with the bros let's see oh <laughs> she looks so cute i really like it now i think i'm just gonna sell the whole thing except this face plate okay because that's the one that i'm after so anyway overall um this android is cute honestly i like the face plate <laughs> it looks so intriguing my gosh so now we will tackle on the next face plate which is the third one and this one has both of them has a shout effect okay yeah kind of the other one looks worried but the other one is the crying face plate and both are shouting i don't know what they're shouting about and this is the detail of the third face plate very detailed the other one doesn't have a bow bro not bow bro wow nice expression though <laughs> this is a number three okay the third one i don't know if you can see the number but it's not that clear because the color of the nandroid is kind of creamy i think white <laughs> okay now so far no dirt we're just checking and let's see if it fits our nandroid okay so if ever you purchase an android make sure that each face plate fits because sometimes it doesn't really and it's really annoying you know <sighs> but i'm not sure guys if a good smell company will replace it if that's the defect because basically you can still use the face plate but the problem is it's not compatible in any hair <laughs> because i have that certain face plate that's really annoying my gosh um any hair will look like this at the side very annoying like this <sighs> so far what we see wow it has a great fitting for this dendroid so again we will put back the small hair pieces and here we go <laughs> oh, wow she looks shocked but i know that there is a, an effect for for this kind of um what they call this pose there needs to be water on her eye i wonder how we can place that but we will see okay you will see how so i will just make her wear this face plate so we can test that water effect okay on her face so far 
We tackle on the face plates and now we will see the other parts here. So she comes with one, two, three, four, four arms. Okay. And it has a plastic as well that you need to remove so that you can take a look of the arms. So we'll see what we got here. So first I'm gonna tackle on to the first set of arms here oh not only arms but here is the water speaking of the water part we will take a look first at the water how can we attach this to the nendoroid Ooh. oh my gosh there you go we remove the plastic and Let's place it on the side and this is the water bar that I told you um, that will be placed on her eyes it doesn't seem like seem like a power thing but she looks so worried when it was placed on her eyes <laughs> I don't know basically what this is because I don't even watch the anime series of this android. So this is the front of whatever it is. <laughs> it looks like an evil eye, honestly. What is an evil eye? Um, luckily, I have this bracelet, okay? Evil eye is this. This one, okay? Um, they say that <laughs> it will remove... Um, negative vibes of people who's casting negative eye on you if there is somebody who's casting then it just means that they're jealous of you or you know are wishing you ill and wearing this stuff can can remove it <laughs> that's the theory <laughs> or the myth about it so yeah it looks like an evil eye okay so you can see here and this is the side and this is hmm interesting actually how can we attach it so this is the back very detailed really even my <laughs> my ring is detailed my gosh <laughs> i forgot to turn it so we'll check how it was done how can we make this android where this um part <laughs> on her eyes so first remove the hair hmm. oh i see probably on the node on the node that we got here but it has on the other side too hmm interesting there's no nodes here and there's holes for this one anyway where did we indicate it at this part right so it's on the left part so we will put that place it on the left part like this attach it to the hole over here attach the node part Oof this is hard just hope it won't fail <sighs> so i think it's not wearable if ever you're like me i'm um, selling hair of this nandroid i would suggest you to to sell the hair in package with the wings attached and <laughs> this effect too because it may not be usable for other nendoroids since the hair part needs a hole to make it attach like this wow this is nice so we will just um arrange don't worry about the pony i keep it okay just place it like this so it's okay so we won't have a hard time removing it so this is how it looks like here is the side 
for her glasses honestly she's shouting but probably it's her power okay i don't know i don't watch her my bad i don't watch her anime so we'll see with the arms first set of arms that we got oops sorry nandroid uh -huh. so here are the arms so first arms that we got is bended arms and in order to attach this one you have to remove this okay not the sleeves but i will show you first Oof. i mean let me borrow your sleeve so this is her sleeve very detailed and you will remove this arm okay to attach the other arm just like that So that's what you need to do. Anyway, I'll show you first uh, the detailed um, extra part of this Nandoroid. But really, I like the dress. So beautiful. I really felt drawn to that jewelry on her chest. Very sexy. <laughs> sexy angel. If you want to make your Nandoroid look like an angel. But anyway... Here is the arm. So it has closed fist. Oh dear, it can't focus. It has closed fist. So you can see. Forgive for the bad lighting, guys. <laughs> I'm using natural light. So yeah, this android is so whitey. That's why you can't really fully see the detail. Okay, but that's how the arms looks like. And let's see the other extra arm that we got here. So, for the extra arm, it's like the praying arm. So, this one comes with a sleeve of the dress. And then, just attach the the left okay the left arm to the right so oh touch it to the node and there we go it's like a brain brain android now we will see how it looks like if the android wear it so so far nice nice nodes and hole because it's not loose sometimes i got nandoroids that has loose nodes or two big holes it's really annoying whenever i want to use the nandoroid it always fell the part always fell i mean <laughs> so yeah so far so good now attach the node to the arm so here we go she looks like praying but she looks very <laughs> but she was in shock oh my gosh <laughs> she looks funny my gosh anyway let's see but I will not keep it, okay? I will not keep that face blade. I already have a shouting one. <laughs> that is cute. Okay. Now, we'll check the other parts that we got. So, we got extra arms. And this one is close fist. So, we have... Oh dear, this is odd. Why we got a lot of close fist hands? Because honestly, this one too is close fist. But very different, I think. This one is much more detailed. The one that is loose. Because the other is not detailed. Really. 
that's funny let me see the box <laughs> she always has clothes please <laughs> she's like going into a fight <laughs> she's funny oh my gosh i just let's see what's the difference i really i'm really curious because both are um close faced so i will just make her wear this okay let's compare what it looks like from the other okay so this is the uh, the one that's attached to the arm and this is the the one that is the touch so as you can see yeah this one is kind of bent like this and the other is just straight punch <laughs> as you can see but the other one the loose part is actually more detailed than oh dear <laughs> forgive it can't view <laughs> it can't focus so this one the loose part is much more detailed honestly so that's the difference at least this one has extra feast nice honestly anyway so this comes with extra legs sexy legs <laughs> so the legs okay she has nice hmm detailed sandals as you can see the other one too and is this for sitting i don't know <laughs> let's see if it is let me see the description where will you use it so to to make her looks like her feet is bending but so far i didn't see any bending position just the po positioning you know but no sitting position so this um what do you call this <laughs> this extra legs we will see later okay how about let's check it now <laughs> so to let's make her fit the legs change my mind sorry <laughs> I got excited so oh it comes with a note and I wasn't able to remove the note if this one very hard oh dear I hope I won't break the nendoroid very detailed skirt there's polka dots there hmm oh there you go <laughs> I told you white undies <laughs> So let's place where is the right, where is the left? Okay, so I think that's it. Let's just place it on the legs. Not on the legs, on the hole. So you can see there's a hole there. There you go. Let's see if you are in sitting position. Can be. <laughs> okay no it's not sitting position it's a scared position <laughs> of the legs oh dear no how can she sit with this <laughs> with this clothing okay even though her sh skirt you know can touch the ground it it still can't can stand up on its own okay so that's what you need to know guys <laughs> all right so you still need a stand for this standard anyway we're done with the parts here now we will see the extra part so it's just a, the stand i think and the extra neck joint for this standard sorry about the noise we're unboxing here so that's why it's gonna be no noisy 
Um, there you go. Ooh. So, yeah, tape. Let's check what kind of stand that we got here. <laughs> okay, if you ask me if this is worth a buy, really depends on you guys. Because honestly, I will only just keep the the second face plate. That's all that I will keep. <laughs> um, I like the clothing, you know, but um, my Nandoroid is kind of conservative. <laughs> all right, all right. Anyway, so here is the stand so it's not a c stand guys because this girl has a long hair and obviously she has a very unique stand attach it to her node to make her stand um by the way the wings that i have is actually you know it should be attached to the stand which is really annoying i don't really like that idea at all so oh dear don't tell me that the body is loose i just hope not oh dear i will just attach it later all right all right now this is um the base stand of the nandroid and what you can see here is a support for your nandroid it's not a c stand obviously and this is the base just basic square stand and it says here ka dokam wa made in china kadokawa i wonder why kadokawa i don't know <laughs> i don't understand anyway so there you go this is the stand square stand for this android and yeah she can use the the what they call this <laughs> the base stand to make it stand even without this one Anyway, so I will just make you see some possible posts for this Nandroid so you may have an idea Where can you use it? How can you use the parts? Whatever Really based on what you want But overall um, I think she she has a great buy of hair because she will have a set She will have this I will call it evil eye <laughs> Evil eye effect. She also have nice wings. Very detailed wings. I forgot to show you the wings. Okay, so for the wings, this is how it looks like. Very detailed, honestly. So here is the back. I don't know if you can see, but there is kind of blue effect on the bottom. Sadly, it can't be shown. <laughs> <laughs> it has blue effect on don't know if you can see that Oof. oh my gosh F forgive so <laughs> the other one has the same details okay very cute wings they have notes i think you can use it if you want okay just put um what they call this <laughs> just put some tacky i don't know if it's called tacky glue <laughs> so that your android may have wings can be right but i don't feel comfortable with that idea honestly because it might fall down anyway so here is what the wings looks like very interesting wings very cute i like the wings but i don't like how it works <laughs> because um i just hope my main character has holes on her hair oh my gosh 
but I don't want to color this um, hair alright so I just leave it here guys I will just you know post some possible positions for this android for you guys to see okay so let's see about it oh i forgot to show you the extra <laughs> neck joint so this android comes with an extra ne neck joint okay um yeah very nice okay that's it so <laughs> we'll proceed now with the pose Alright, so for this pose, I just use the primary face plate and oh dear, I really had a hard time putting the stand on her. <laughs> it's very difficult guys, okay? And yeah, and I also use the praying hands for this pose. Actually, this is the only serious face plate that she has <laughs> and that's why I use the main or the primary face plate that this android wear when we first saw her. <laughs> okay, anyway, let's see about the next possible pose. so for this pose i use the one that i like <laughs> that the one that i will not sell probably well i'll test it first for my android if it looks nice but if it doesn't probably i will sell it by the way this is a great face plate you know because you can make it as if your android is angry or complaining at the same time you may make it seem like your android is crying at the same time <laughs> really this is um a good face plate to have anyway these two um it reminds me of the other face plate i used to have this kind of expression and i don't have it anymore someone um bought it already <laughs> okay so this is a great buy honestly i just don't like the fact that the wings is attached to the hair i thought that i can use it to my other nendoroids too but even though we'll say that we can use stock glue i don't really like the idea of it because it can place dirt on your nendoroid and at the same time the hassle is there that the parts may gone loose and i don't like it <laughs> okay so i will just still like the after i forgot the name <laughs> the one that where i got my wings i'll just show to you the wings that i have right so this is what i got so i think it's after parts is what it's called and this one comes with a halo together with the wings okay so mine is kind of dirty because it's old already all right and let's check it's very different you have to place it on the nendoroid stand i mean the stand support okay to make it sorry to make it look like hmm I forgot actually how to use it kind of like this okay you need um a node to use this one <sighs> that's why i'm not really that comfortable in <laughs> having this one but you can use actually taki glue at least it's only one piece unlike the other it's two pieces right and if one accidentally fell it it will be a problem but this one is only one and you can easily see this because it's big so anyway um so far you can only use those wings if you have this hair that we have oops <laughs> oh my gosh this is the problem too like i don't know if it's normal that this easily was the touch <laughs> all right sorry for the bloopers 
See, I told you it's very hard to attach the stand. <laughs> anyway, thank you for watching and sending you all peace, love, and light. Bye!